the one thing different is uh, that for omentectomy and the paraerotic lymph node dissection, I turn the robotic dog 180 degree. Uh, at uh, this time, the uh, target point uh, is uh, upper paraerotic area. Uh, this is an uh, early stage epithelial ovarian cancer. She already underwent a laparoscopic, right, something oophorectomy to uh, in another hospital. Uh, uh, the surgery was done initially for a uh, benign looking tumor, but the final pathology was a high grade uh, ovarian cancer. I, and I performed the robotic restaging surgery for this patient. Now I perform a robotic hysterectomy uh, in staging purpose. Usually, I cut the anterior and posterior phonics first and then uh, cut the, uh, both the uterine artery to uh, secure the uterine artery well. After removing the uh, specimen, uh, now I am uh, repair the vagina stump using barbed suture. This is a Korean one, it's a very convenient one. And usually, uh, I close the uh, vagina from right to left, and then come back to the right. I mean, I uh, close the uh, vagina stump twice to uh, prevent uh, uh, stump distance and to avoid the uh, fluid leakage from peritoneal cavity after cavity through vagina after lymph node dissection. And next the procedure is a uh, uh, pelvic lymph node dissection. Sometimes uh, I uh, perform hysterectomy first, and sometimes uh, uh, I perform uh, pelvic lymph node dissection first. Uh, in this case, uh, all lymphatic tissue uh, was uh, removed from the pelvic vessels and the obturator knob with the pet pad. And then I rotated the robotic deck to perform omentectomy and the paraerotic lymph node dissection. At this time, the uh, target point is the upper paraerotic area. Now I'm performing uh, partial omentectomy. And this case is a uh, early stage epithelial ovarian cancer, so implant only omentectomy or partial omentectomy is enough procedure. Uh, we can cut the uh, implant folic omentum uh, using energy device directly, but I prefer uh, to dissect the omentum from uh, the attachment to transverse colon. If we do this, we can uh, cut the omentum as much as we want. I mean, we can uh, tailor the extent of uh, uh, omentectomy. Now I am uh, cut the uh, attachment between uh, omentum and the transverse colon using monopolar bobby. Of course, we can use the energy device here also, but this is a avascular plan. Uh, monopolar uh, bobby is faster, so I prefer uh, monopolar bobby. And uh, uh, I use additional two uh, robotic instruments. Left one is uh, penetrated bipolar uh, forceps, and the right one is uh, progressive forceps. Uh, it is very uh, important to differentiate uh, omental plane from uh, mesentery plane of uh, the transverse colon. If you if we make the injury to the mesentery of the transverse colon, sometimes we need the transverse colon resection. Uh, and uh, sometimes it's very difficult to differentiate the omentum from uh, transverse colon mesentery because of adhesion or tumor involvement. And then I cut the omentum using uh, hand instrument uh, energy device. This is a boy and it's very fast, so these days I prefer.